Hey there, some Midian here, and welcome back to Knights of the Old Republic. Last time, we won some swoop races, got threatened by a piggy, and learned more about Jolie's friend, whose name I don't remember. He's been arrested for murdering a Sith woman, and we're going to help prove that he's innocent. Probably. Uh, so we talked to all the judges. We didn't learn anything important from them, other than they're all biased in their own special way. So today, we're going to go to the inn where she was murdered. See if we can talk to some of the witnesses. I don't think it's an inn. I think it's a hotel. This this isn't ye olde fantasy video game. You don't have inns here. So the hotel was somewhere. It wasn't in the area I was just in. I've been there before. I'm pretty sure it's in like the East East, not the Central East, but the East East. The city is very fun with its naming convention. You got the Central East, you've got the East East, you got the Central West, you got the West West. Yeah, see East Central. Was the hotel here? No, I think it was full East. Oh no, the hotel's here. So we're going to interrogate the witnesses using our great interrogation mind control powers that we are so good at. Hello! I'm back. You are the one defending Sunri now, huh? Well, the hotel's open for you. And I guess I gotta answer any questions you want, too. Uh, tell me what you saw the night of the murder. Jolie, please stop teleporting. The Sith woman, Alasa, rented a room in the hotel. An hour or two later, Sunri comes in and goes to her room. A couple hours later, I hear a blaster shot and see Sunri running. He can't run good because he's a cripple, but he still was going pretty fast. I would swear he started after the shot, though. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm pretty damn sure he left after the shot went off. Could it have gone off after he left? No, I don't think so. I mean, it's possible, just barely. But I wouldn't say that to the court. Uh... Why wouldn't you say it to the court? What do you want to know? I don't want to force him to testify in that way just yet. Uh, what do you know about Sunri and Alasa? Alasa used to rent rooms here every week or so. Then Sunri would come by a couple hours later and stay all night. It doesn't take a genius to figure out what was going on. So who are the witnesses in the hotel? There were only two other people in the hotel when it happened. One was a Rodian named Glupor. Seems like a really dirty, shifty type. Normally, I don't let his kind in here. I'm a reputable businessman, you know. But there weren't many people here, so I decided to take a chance. The other is a regular named Feareth Me. He's a Pazak player. Probably an addict, but he claims he's big in some circles. Don't know anything about him other than that. Anything else you want to know? Nope. Well, okay. If you... Thanks for the information. Heard the blaster shot go off and then saw Sunri hobbling away. Okay. Let's talk to the other witnesses. Hello, feareth me. You with the cell cat? You here to see me about the murder too? I told the damn fish everything I knew. What more do you all want from me? What do you know about Sunri and Alasa? Sunri, I only heard of once or twice in passing. Some sort of old time war hero against the Sith. Seen him around in the hotel, too. Going to Alas's room always, of course. Kept the rest of the building up half the night with their damn antics, usually. So you mean Sunri was having a relationship with Alasa? I'm not saying anything like that. What they did in that room, in private, is their business. And there isn't any rule against Sith and Republic seeing each other for personal reasons. Although if you think her Sith Master didn't know, <laughs> you must be fooling yourself. So, what about that Sith Master? Oh, uh, well, Alasa was a Sith, so of course she'd have to have someone above her. Yeah, I, I didn't see anything. 
You know you want to tell me. You know, I think I could trust you. Heck, I don't even know why I shouldn't tell you. Well, one time, I saw Alasa coming in wearing this big cloak. I was on my way to my room, and she normally wears stuff like that, so I didn't pay her too much attention. But this time, I accidentally brushed up against her. Accidentally, of course. And her cloak fell open. Now, I don't have any qualms about the Sith. I leave them alone, and they leave me alone. And seeing as how Alasa had a Sith lightsaber under her cloak, I'm not going to poke that hornet's nest. So she was a Jedi. Seems so. But I'm not getting myself in any further with the Sith. I know how ruthless they are. Now that's all I'm going to tell you. I'll testify it to the court, but you aren't going to get anything else out of me. Alright. Why is... What? Why does that give me dark side cloaks? Fuck you. Uh, can I steal your ship? I thank you. Don't mind me. <laughs> Jolie, you're, you're gonna have to get out of yes. my way, my guy. What? Alright, so... Grit told you he brushed up against the loss and her cloak fell open to reveal that she was carrying a lightsaber, the mark of a Jedi. I've seen that the loss may have been a dark Jedi allied with the Sith. Or professed the Sunrise Innocent. She claims some sort of frame up by someone who wants to get revenge on him. Someone was an old wartime hero, blah, 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 blah. You've heard rumors that Sunri may have been cheating on his wife. Perhaps you should ask Alora about this. Oh, Alora Sunri's. Uh oh. Hmm. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure this will be fine. Hello. I have a question about the murder of Alasa. Uh, why were you at the hotel? So what did you see? Hmm. That doesn't sound suspicious in the slightest. What about Alasa's room? You want to tell me who paid you and for what? Hmm. So he planted the metal on the body. Do you know anything about a star map? Alright. So this guy planted the metal as evidence against Sunri. Seems the Sith are trying to blame him. Pop it. It's in the footlocker. Med pack. Uh, yeah, all of these are. All these don't work because of the murder investigation. Can I go into the room of the murder, which I'm going to assume is this one? I, I guess not. Alright, Mr. Ignis. You are the one defending. The Sith, he can't... No. Yeah, I'll tell the court Sunri left before the shot went off. Hmm, I guess this is what they call working the system. Not that I'm objecting, I just hope the Selkath don't find out about it. Now, was there anything else you wanted? Nope. Well, okay. If you need anything else, I'm gonna be right here. Let me guess, dark side points gained. No? I mind controlled this guy to give false testimony and don't get dark side points. I mind controlled this guy to tell the truth and do get dark side points. This is why binary light dark bullshit is you, Jedi. 
I hear not you good. are investigating the Sunry murder trial, are you not? Hmm. This case is not at all what it appears to be. Many currents, might I say, flow beneath the surface. What do you mean? This murder is much more complicated than it may first appear. Sunri and Elasa are proxies for their governments, and both sides want the other to fail. You can see the journey uh, by the footprints. You understand, yes? Uh, not really. What do you mean? Oh, dear, dear. I'm saying they both had something to do with it. They both kept their hands in this from the start. If you want to get to the bottom of this murder, you might seek information from both the Sith and the Republic. Likely in their embassies. And you think they just give it to me? No, of course not. You think state secrets are for sale on the common market? You would have to be hmm, devious to get what you want. Heed my advice, Jedi, and you may yet find the truths in this murder. I mean, he's got a point. We know that the Sith paid that guy to plant some evidence, and that she was a dark Jedi. But well, that's all we know. Maybe we could learn some more, some more secrets. Have you managed to retrieve? No. The time is a. Okay, this guy's just not gonna tell me anything. But this computer terminal gave me an option to open that door over there. Let me quick save in case this turns bad. Uh, no one here is good at computers. You're at like plus one, right? Yeah, you're at plus one computer use, which is the best I've got, so get on in there, Mr. Lee. Downloading Sunry Incident Archive. He did do it. However, you have found a data recording that clearly shows Sunry killing the Sith woman, Elasa. Can you continue your role of arbiter impartially, knowing that your client has committed such a crime? No. Actually. Sure. Hmm. I may have just mind controlled people to admit that they helped, uh. Hmm. I thought that would open this door. But uh, apparently that is not the case. Hmm. What to do now? I mean, I guess I'm giving them the evidence. Right? I mean, he did do it. I don't know what the circumstances were of him doing it. Maybe I need to go into the Sith base to find that, but... I feel like... Hmm. Should I break into the Sith base first? And see if I can get information in there. Before... I make my decision. I think I will. We're making a detour. Okay, Jolie wants to talk to me. What's up? You got something on your mind? Uh, you never did actually say why you decided to come with me. No, I never did, did I? Are you always going to be this elusive? Elusive? Me elusive? Obviously, you've never tried to grab a Twi'lek dancing girl after drinking too much Andorin Willick juice. At any rate, I already told you why I wanted to leave. I'd seen everything I wanted to on Kashyyyk. Time to go. Time to move on. And move on to where? To bed. I'm old and tired, you know. No. Just tell me. How many kilometer high trees could you find an interest in before you figure you've had enough? 
I bet you can't be bothered to stay in one room for more than 50 minutes. Then there's all the critters in the Shadowlands. I'm just happy to be back in space, doing something new. Is that too much to ask? I uh, guess not. There. Now, was that so hard? An old man has to be allowed some petty eccentricities. Nice to see you agree for once. I'll admit, for all its flaws, Kashik was home enough. But when you came along and I saw the destiny you had before you, I couldn't help but be intrigued. And what interest do you have in my future? Interest? Well, I certainly don't have a vested interest. Call it more idle curiosity. Your destiny is rather unclear. In fact, everything about you that I can see is odd. Slightly off, as if my eyes are trying to trick me. Something... something is very dark about you. But... ah, I'm sure you don't need to hear my ruminations. You've probably got enough nosy Jedi offering you one opinion after another to make you sick. Now, please, tell me more. Your future will come of its own accord, trust me. Sometimes navel-gazing at it doesn't get you anywhere. I wouldn't worry about it too much if I were you. You remind me a bit of Nomi. <laughs> that can be all bad. Well, who's Nomi? Nomi Sunrider. She came late to the Force, just as you have, and became one of the greatest Jedi ever. Oh, fine, fine lass. Whether you'll follow the same path remains to be seen. For one thing, we'll never get anywhere if you stand around chatting up old men all day. So, you're along as some kind of observer? Nonsense. Have I ever refused to help you when you asked? How confused can one person be anyway? One thing I will say is that this little escapade does remind me a bit of my adventuring days before the war. Ah, uh, those were exciting times. Or at least it would remind me of those times if we didn't stand around. What's keeping you? Too young to be so talkative. Shoo! Shoo! Alright. So apparently we're like a woman named Nomi Sunrider. One of the greatest Jedi ever. That's cool. I like being compared to one of the greatest Jedi ever. So we're gonna go break into the Sith base and maybe learn more about Sunri's murder. Or Sunri murdering the... The loss is murder. Yeah, that's the one. Sunri wasn't murdered. My current inclination is to just give them the evidence that Sunri murdered her and call it a day. Now, this is the private Sith hangar, which we got codes to go into, I think. Uh, pretty sure we did. So we're going to go in there, guns blazing. And by guns, I mean lightning bolts. And see where that takes us. Hi. I'm gonna try and fear this guy and then go ham on this guy. You are just going to go right on ahead. And lightning bolt. You are also just gonna attack this guy. Alright, this guy is very dead. Okay, the fear worked on him. And you need. That was sure. extremely free. I'm sure it'll get harder later, once we are actually in the city. Or in the base. Okay, so this transport should take me to the Jedi Embassy. Let's go. Take the transport to the Sith base.
spot at the door we came in from get permanently sealed. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense. And this is why we brought the Wookiee. Pick up some mines for us that we're probably going to sell in the future. What? Okay, which way do I want to go first? Let's go this way. Let's go this way. <laughs> Control. Oh, hello. Okay, you go ham here. Yes. You give him the zap. And you assist in killing this guy. Oh. Yes? <laughs> Bam! He's doing pretty well. I assumed that the planets would, like, scale based on the order you did them in. So, I assumed that, like, this would be harder than Tatooine and Kashyyyk, but it's looking like that might not be the case. <sighs> what data pad did I just get? Water pump analysis. In regards to the system in place to cycle water from the ocean to the thermal heaters, what were you thinking? What made you put that airlock mechanism mechanism on the only other path to the north side of the base. Now everyone has to know how to cycle the water out of one room and into the adjoining one for each of the three rooms in sequence without accidentally flooding the room they're in. We lost seven troopers this past week. Next time I'm there, you better show me how to do it properly. I can't afford to lose any more of my aids while trying to get to the cell cath. Sorry, sir, but we had to change the pump mechanism once one of those fish people swam into one of the intakes outside. The external flow controls push the water into the chambers north and south only now. Flow controls on the inside wall switches the water between sides east and west. The trick now is to push the water to the north and south extremes, then switch the water east, west, and walk through. The meters by the flow control panel show there is water in the adjacent room. Also installed life form detection sensors, so there shouldn't be any more aid problems. Trying to get the system passed as quickly as possible, sir, but the self cath authority is monitoring our base and made this much more difficult. What the fuck are they doing? Water has been transferred to an adjoining pressure chamber. What in the fuck is this bullshit? Okay, so there's water in here now, but no water in here. There's water in here. Okay, there's water in that room, but not water in this room. If I move this, it should... This control panel is currently not functioning. Okay. So, I want water in here. Oh, well, goodbye, Julie. It was nice knowing you. Let me, let me fix that real quick. <laughs> See, he's fine. No, nothing to worry about. So there's water. There's water in this room.
Is there water in here right now? Is that what I did? Yes. What's in here? Oh, bad boys. Yes. Okay, let me get some lightning bolts. Yes? This isn't helping me with the fucking water puzzle. Let me figure this out. So there's water in this room. There's water in that room. There's not water in this room, but there is water in this room. If I press this... Warning. I'm gonna press F5 in case I fuck up and drown myself at some point. So, I can't do anything in these two rooms without drowning myself, so let me push the water over here. Wait, what? Both are filled with water? Okay, this should push the water over there. Yeah? Wait, no. There's no water in here? No, there's no water in here. Okay, that pushed the water over there. So this control panel is malfunctioning, but... If I do this, that pulls the water into this room. And then, no, oh, this room's filled with water. How does this work? Okay, this pushes it forward? Okay, so there's water in here, water in there. There's no water in here. Let me read this again. <laughs> I'm very bad at puzzles, apparently. Okay, the, the external flow controls push the water into the chambers north and south. The flow controls on the inside wall switches the water between sides east and west. Push the water to the north and south extremes, then switch the water east-west and walk through. So, I want it to go... I want to push it to the extremes? So I want it to be all on this side. Right? Okay, okay. You two idiots, get out. Get out here. So if I do this, I'm pulling that water into this room. Yeah? And then if I do this, I pull that water into this room. That doesn't help me. And then if I do this, I pull 
that water into this room. Okay, so there's water there. There's water in the bottom left room. And in the top right room. Yeah. So what happens if I press this? I don't understand. Hold up. I'm gonna quick save and see if I just fucking kill myself by doing this. I think Warning. I do. Activating. No, it pushed it that way. I don't... I don't understand. I'm too stupid for the shit. Okay, let's continue our exploration. Give him the AoE. Why are you melee attacking, dumbass? I heard I Being force choked over here? Yes, it's fine. Just heal my friends. Oh, he spins. Good work, Jolie. Bop it. Bop it. Strength plus two, you say? That is more than strength plus one. Uh, does anyone get more damage from this? You get more damage. But lower defense, that's fine. Just beat people up, why not? Does this give you more defense? No. Okay, so you can keep wearing nothing. Yes? Ah, I've been... I've been tricked. Bio antidote package. To immunity to poison. That's cool. Wear that for now. Yes? I can't believe I've been bamboozled by a trap. Some new crystals in here that I'm not entirely sure if they're good or not. God, these med packs are worthless. I guess that's what happens when you're using basic ass med packs and don't have any first aid skill. What's in here? More bad men for me to do bad things to. <laughs> what? Jolie, what are you doing? Also, I just got fucking heard of it. No, don't med pack. Use an antidote, kid. Sure. Wait, doesn't this heal poison? Whatever. Let's use the antidote, kid. Okay, what do we have in here? Oh. Jolie, mm -hmm. we need your plus one hacking skill, please. I do not have a lot of s computer spikes, so I need to save them. Hi, that's us. Where are there Selkath? That thing looks cool. 
Okay. I was hoping that would have something about the murder, but apparently not. I need to save my... I need to save my computer spikes for what? when I find something involving the murder. Let me quick save. I haven't saved in a bit. Hello. Wait, wait, wait. Normal attack, and then this. Bam! That's fun. That jump attack is very fun. I don't know how good it is, but it's really fun to close distance that quickly. Okay, this looks like it's probably going to have a lot of people in it. Uh, yeah, a lot of people. Big old two. Charlie just walked into a, a mine. Apparently this team's awareness is not high enough, or whatever the skill is to make you see things. Yes? Could I not just have come this way? Oh. This is going to be rough. I don't have stun droid on any of these characters, do I? Oh, disable droid. Will this work? Yeah, it sure fucking did. Good work. Now, actually, disable droid on this one, too. And then just go ham. Take that. That hurt. Okay, I assumed these guys were going to be harder than they actually were, considering they were assault droids Mark IV. Okay, I, I figured out why I couldn't just go this way. I figured out the puzzle. Sure. The puzzle is there's a there's a force field in the way. just bust it down? It's one of those locks, huh? One of those you can't proceed until you've done whatever thing you need to do in the story locks. That kind of lock. Uh, how am I doing on time? This video has been going on a decent amount, but I would like to clear this dungeon if possible. Pretty sure this should just push it into. Okay. Uh, that sort of worked. Okay, so this led to the force field. But I'm gonna open the door anyways, just in case there's like something in here, but there wasn't. I'm just leaving the security lady to her own devices. It's a faulty war. Got a lot of repair parts. We could repair this. I don't feel like we need to. Yes. <laughs> Oh, I'm not walking into mines. People are like throwing grenades at me. Holy shit. Sure. You know, kill this grenadier. 
Alright, what do we got in here? Security decryption interface, universal computer interface. Those are droid parts, I think. So we good if I ever use one of my droids. So let's deal with this thing. I got a data module. Oh right, that's the thing that I was supposed to do for the Republic. I forgot. I forgot that that was the reason I'm here. All right, Zolber, you got. You need to level up. Okay, I need to get your awareness up because I've been having trouble seeing some mines. And Mr. Bindo has also leveled up. Alright, you're also leveling awareness, so I don't need to level it on Zalbar. Uh, destroy droid. I mean, disable droid worked really well against that one thing. This is specifically extremely useful against robots. Sounds good enough to me. What? So we got what we came for. I guess we just leave now? Yes. But we didn't find anything about the murder. What? These guys did not have loot, the other two had loot. Oh, this area's gonna have a lot of people in it, I think. The West Lounge. That sounds like the place where people would be. Uh, it's less people than I thought. Let's have these two just go ham on the human and you... Disable or destroy some droids. Like, they can't do anything in 12 seconds. That seems pretty powerful. Oh, 12 seconds is a lot less time than I thought, apparently. Sure. North computer room. Am I dead? No, but I'm going to assume if I walk through that, I'm dead. That door was locked. This has steam that I'm gonna quick save and walk through it, but I'm gonna assume if I do so, I'm just gonna fucking die. Uh, that's not as bad as I thought. I mean, it did some damage, but it's an acceptable parameters. Steam control. Yeah, just turn that shit off. We have over here. <clears throat> okay, Jolie, I'm going to need you to use this. Unable to reach target? You use it on yourself, my guy. Do I need to be like right in front of the panel? Okay, this shit just doesn't work. Oh, this doesn't do anything. I could disable the force field from this, but...
I think I have just wasted two computer spikes again. That's fine. What? I mean, the only place I can go... What the fuck is the point of this room? There's a door that doesn't go anywhere and a computer panel that... is the same as the other computer panel. Okay, I believe the only place we have left to go is the uh, receptionist. Maybe she can unlock this door? Hi. You there. I don't recognize you. How did you get in here? We are authorized to be here. You! I don't recognize you. I know the face of every Sith on this planet. We'll get to the bottom of this. Commander Gran, report to the security desk immediately. You authorize this person to enter? I don't know them. And their identification doesn't match up. They're spies. What? Sound the alarm! Droids, destroy them! Uh... Okay, you, instead of destroying droids, just use a bunch of force lightning and hit, like, a lot of them at once. Can I hit, like, multiple things at once? Yeah, that worked pretty good. Yeah, that worked pretty well. Yes. Good work, team. Well, this is my way out, but is there a way for me to get into the back room? Nerve enhancement package. Immunity to mind affecting. Decent enough, but I don't have the skills to use it. Alright. Uh, I think I'm done in here, and I think that's a good time to stop the video. I didn't get any information about the murder, unfortunately, but... I mean, I have proof that he did it, so I guess I'm just going to give them the proof that he did it. Alright. It's not the right thing to do. The Sith are assholes. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'll think about it between videos. But that's going to do it for today. Next time we're going to go deal with the whole Jolie's friend situation, whose name I still forgot. Sunry. Sunry. That's where I went. I remembered it. We're going to decide whether or not to help him or let him accept his fate. He did the deed. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.